Howdy, I'm Jeffrey Snover, a technical fellow at Microsoft, and uh, I'm the chief architect of the Azure Storage and Cloud Edge team. So that includes lots of stuff like Azure Stack. Uh, well, I actually invented PowerShell, so from the very beginning. <laughs> yeah, so in fact, Azure Stack, I talked about this in my talk, Azure Stack uh, is a very large, complex system, right? four to 16 servers per rack, multiple racks, multiple top of rack switches, over 30 VMs with multiple levels of high availability and continuous availability, and the entire thing is built using PowerShell. I have over 250,000 lines of PowerShell and desired state configuration, and indeed, it's absolutely dependent on PowerShell. Yeah, I am firmly convinced that PowerShell is a critical skill set for uh, IT. You know, there's this idea of like a cr uh, full stack developer. I believe that a cross stack IT pro is going to be the job of the future, which is to say that a, someone that can manage things, whether it's Windows or Linux, whether it's running on Azure, AWS, Google, or uh, on-premises using Hyper-V or VMware, and PowerShell is the tool that allows you to invest in your career, invest in your technical skills, and then be able to manage any of those things. So it's absolutely critical. Yeah, so what I learned at this conference was all the great ways the community is taking PowerShell to solve their problems. Saw a great talk about DBA tools and how they were able to take the testing framework and PowerShell and really just increase the quality of uh, their database uh, environments by testing them. So. What I like best about this conference is the incredible community. It's a very technical community. And so while the talks are great, the conversations after the talks, sometimes we call this hobby or hallway con or lobby con, a number of people will meet in the lobby of the hotel and just carry on the conversations. That's what's the best, is the conversations. Yeah, what's great about the, this conference is uh, to find the best practices of the community. You find people take the same tool, but then they view it a little bit differently and are able to do interesting things with it. And so you get to see those different perspectives, and then that helps you up your own game.